aside from knowing the rules of procedure and the rules of evidence like the back of your hand, practice a law, trial law, litigation, uh, in my opinion, is won or lost before you enter the courtroom, like in a sporting uh, event. Preparation cannot be understated. You need to know your judge and research the lawyers on the other side. Who, who are your opponents? Additionally, your lawyer must be confident, have emotional intelligence, including the ability to read and respond to others, have adaptability to think, to be able to think quickly on their feet and adjust to any arguments and strategies uh, when necessary. They must be highly ethical and be able to communicate well and be able to tell the client's story because that's what litigation is really about. It's about competing stories. I'm a graduate of Stetson University College of Law with honors. I'm licensed to practice not only in Florida, but Washington, D.C. and Texas. I'm admitted to the 11th Circuit Court of Appeals, all the federal courts in the state of Florida, the International Court of Trade, the United States Supreme Court, and the United States Tax Court. After law school, I was a former assistant state attorney where I prosecuted all kinds of crimes from misdemeanors to felonies. After I left the state attorney's office as a prosecutor, I went back to law school and got an advanced law degree and an LLM in international law and business. I've been nominated as one of Florida's super lawyers from 2017 to 2023 in business litigation and in Florida's legal elite for commercial and business litigation. I'm one of less than 300 lawyers in the state of Florida that are board certified in business litigation. So my background and experience in both the criminal practice and the business practice make me, I think, uniquely qualified in handling cases where there may be a concern for people that have exposure in either area and to be aware of those areas. I've taught continuing education classes to lawyers and have done writings on judgment enforcement and post-judgment proceedings, types of damages in business litigation cases, handling a business divorce, drafting covenants, representations and warranties and contracts, the intersection of probate litigation and business litigation, proper time billing and collections for attorney's fees, handling an international criminal narco-trafficking case, the perils of practicing international criminal defense. I've drafted articles on the 10 international treaties and conventions that every U.S. lawyer should know. I've taught courses on evidence, and I've taught courses on the law of private placement memorandums.